A trial is underway at Limerick Circuit Criminal Court of three men, including All-Ireland winning hurler Kyle Hayes, who are charged with offences relating to incidents alleged to have happened in and outside a Limerick nightclub four years ago. The court heard that a man was kicked and punched on the ground. Five-time All-Ireland winner and four-time All-Star, 25-year-old Kyle Hayes with an address at Ballyashea in Kildimo County, Limerick, has pleaded not guilty to two counts of violent disorder and one count of assault causing harm. Offences alleged to have occurred in and outside the Icon nightclub in Limerick early on October the 28th of 2019. 22-year-old Jay Chowdhury of Carheny in Kildimo denies a charge of assault causing harm and a violent disorder charge, while a third defendant, 24-year-old Craig Cosgrave, seen here on the left in the green jacket, of Caharali in Grange County, Limerick, has pleaded not guilty to violent disorder. Opening the prosecution case today, Barrister John O'Sullivan said that the alleged injured party in this case Killian McCarthy was on a night out and ended up at the Icon nightclub on Upper Denmark Street in Limerick with Craig Cosgrave, who was a friend of his at the time. Killian McCarthy was speaking to two girls in the nightclub, the prosecution said, and Kyle Hayes, who was present and acquainted with the girls, became upset about this. Killian McCarthy was then set upon by Kyle Hayes and others, according to the prosecution, and numerous punches were thrown. It's also alleged that Killian McCarthy was attacked outside the nightclub by Kyle Hayes and that Jay Chowdhury was a participant in this incident. According to the prosecution, two Gardaí saw Kyle Hayes and two others punch and kick Killian McCarthy while Mr McCarthy was on the ground. Detective Garda Barry Moylan said that CCTV clips shown to the court showed numerous people throwing punches inside the nightclub, including Kyle Hayes. Detective Garda Moylan said that Kyle Hayes and another male seemed to have instigated what happened inside the nightclub based on the CCTV footage that was shown to the court. The trial continues tomorrow. Conor Kane, RG News, Limerick Circuit Criminal Court.